Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today is July 22nd, 2024. Today I trained for sprinting. I am trying to break the world record for the 60 meters for the 60 age group, which is about 7.3 something. I did six sprints today. Some of them were 7.9, some of them eight seconds, but the last one was 7.5. Let me take a minute to talk about today's sponsor. Today's sponsor is Fitville. I will send these sneakers to determine if they are good. And let me tell you, I, I've been walking with them all day, as you can see. First thing I noticed when I put the sneakers on is the comfort. I mean, on my knees, I felt less pressure. I don't have any knee pains, but I switched sneakers just to see if it was just a mental thing. I put them back on. I mean, it's like you're walking on a cloud. If you have any knee problems, foot problems, circulation problems, hip problems, back problems, these sneakers will help you. Let me talk a little bit about Fitville. Fitville sneakers are a game changer. Anyone looking to enhance their foot health and overall well-being. Here's why you should consider buying them. Number one, ergonomic design. Fitville sneakers are crafted with a focus on ergonomics, ensuring that your feet are well supported throughout the day. The wide toe box and high instep provide ample space, reducing pressure and enhancing comfort for people with wider feet or foot conditions like bunions. Number two, superior comfort. These sneakers feature a dual density sole that offers excellent cushioning and shock absorption, minimizing the impact on your joints and preventing fatigue. This makes them ideal for those who are on their feet for extended periods or engage in high impact activities. Number three, breathability and durability. Made from high quality materials, Fitville sneakers are both breathable and durable. The mesh upper allows for maximum airflow, keeping your feet cool and dry, while the sturdy construct ensures longevity, even with regular use. The next benefit is the health benefits. Wearing Fitville sneakers can help improve posture and alleviate common food problems such as plantar fasciitis, flat feet, and overpronation. The arch support and cushion insoles promote proper alignment and reduce strain on the feet arch. It has many positive reviews. If you go to their website, customers rave about the comfort and support provided by Fitville sneakers. Many users have reported significant relief from chronic foot pain and overall improvement in their mobility and daily comfort. Fitville sneakers are not just a purchase. They are an investment in your foot health. Whether you're an athlete, a busy professional, or someone dealing with a foot pain, these sneakers offer the perfect blend of comfort support and durability. In the description, I put a link and a discount code of 28%. A discount code is Longevity28. If you purchase from this company, you will get a 28% discount. All I know is when I put them on, I could instantly feel less pressure on my knee. I don't have any knee problems, but I, can still, I still feel it. I feel like I'm walking on a cloud, literally. I, I'm not kidding. I'm not, I am not, I mean, they feel, for me, I'm going to use these to walk, walk around. I'm going to use this every day. Let's get back to the video. Did you know that sprinting is a powerful, powerful longevity exercise that offers numerous benefits for longevity and overall health? Let me, let me break down some of the key benefits of sprinting, and each will be supported by scientific studies. Number one, it stimulates growth hormone. Sprint training increases the release of growth hormone, which plays a critical role in reversing the body's internal clock and enhancing overall vitality. A study on exercise and its impact on aging highlights the longevity benefits of increased growth hormone levels due to high intensity exercise, such as sprinting. Number two, it boosts testosterone. Regular sprint training, regular, can elevate testosterone level, which is essential for muscle maintenance, energy levels. Research has shown that high intensity exercise like sprint is linked to higher testosterone production 
contributing to improved metabolic and muscular health. Number three, it activates fast switch type 2X muscle fibers. Sprinting engages in type 2X muscle fibers known as the fast switch speed power, which are beneficial for maintaining strength and agility. Studies have shown that high intensity sprinting improves the function and preservation of these muscle fibers, which are crucial as we age. We lose these. The next one, number four, it reduces visceral fat. High intensity sprint training effectively reduces visceral fat. That's the fat fat around your organs, which is linked to improved metabolic health and decreased risk of chronic diseases. Sprints are so good. Research supports the notion that vigorous activities such as sprinting significantly reduces visceral fat compared to lower intensity exercises like jogging. Jogging is good, but you got to sprint, baby. Number five, enhances metabolic health. The intense nature of sprinting improves insulin sensitivity and moderate metabolic rate. I have perfect blood glucose, HbA1c, perfect. Anyway, contributing to better overall metabolic health. Studies have shown that high-intensity training can significantly enhance metabolic functions and reduce the risk of metabolic syndrome. Many people get this as they age. Sprint, baby, sprint. Next one, it stimulates the neuromuscular system. Sprint training activates and enhances the neuromuscular, the connection, the conversation between brain and muscles, helping maintain coordination and muscle function. Research indicates that high intensity exercises like sprinting improves neuromuscular function, which is vital, vital for maintaining mobility and preventing falls in older adults. As we age, we lose that mobility. We got to maintain sprinting. Don't forget sprinting. The next one slows the loss of fast motor units in aging. Regular sprint training helps slow down the age-related decline in fast motor units, aiding in the preservation of muscle mass and function, and many other things because motor units is connected to longevity, lifespan, etc. Next one, maintaining strength and power. Engaging in sprinting helps maintain muscle strength and power. Essential for functional abilities and overall quality of life. This includes for any age, not just the old, older people. Research highlights that the benefits of high intensity training in preserving muscle mass and power, which are extremely important for healthy aging. The next one, preservation of telomere lengths. Activities like sprinting are associated with better preservation of telomere length compared to jogging, lower intensity training, like, you know, going to the gym. I mean, it's good, but you need to sprint. This preservation is linked to slower biological age. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you the warm up I did. I did a 400 meters first. I think I did it in like 64, 65 seconds in the rain. But I didn't go all out because it was raining and the, the track was kind of wet. But I did the six sprints, and the first five, I didn't go all out. I mean, I did a little, you know, enough, over 90%. But when I got to the finish line, I slowed down the first five. So I did it in like 7.98 seconds. And I didn't, take, I didn't take too many breaks, too long a break between each of those five sprints. I took like maybe two-minute, three-minute uh, rest. The sixth one, I decided to do one more. I took a rest. I stretched out for 10 minutes. I was relaxed. And I did my sixth one, 7.5. It's not official because it's not electronically timed, but it's close. 7.3 something, was, I forgot exactly the number, but 7.36, 7.378, I mean, somewhere around there. The upper, seven, the upper threes is the world record, the world record for the 60 meter dash. I'm coming for you. 60 meter world record, I'm freaking coming for you. To be a badass at 100 years old, you got to kick ass at 60, 70, 80. Move like someone half your age. That's my motto. I wish you all the best. Check out the sprints. See you in my next video. Morning rain here. July 22nd, 2024. I am training the 400 meters. There's nobody here but that two starting line and the finish line. No cheating. I'm just going to run a lap real quick to see what I'm running in.
It goes one way, baby. I don't know what I'm ready with, but I'm going to time it. Training never stops. Rain or snow or sunshine. Let me end with one more 60 meter dash. July 22nd, 2024. This is my sixth one and my last one. It's pouring rain. One more. Last one. I'm gonna see what I ran it in. Ah, raining. Ah, I'm not even tired. 